Hey guys and welcome back to City Skylines, the sprawling mass of Twitchtopia. Uh, Tweetopia, of course, uh, there was no T in this this time. Uh, welcome back, we are carrying on our strive towards the Megaopolis that we are going to make, but we appear to have a few issues here. Uh, one of them being, of course, the fact that we have no electricity for our stuff down that way. Let's get rid of that. Uh, now, what we could do is build a coal power plant, but I think this is going to like far outstrip what we need. So... Keeping in with the uh, the whole green power thing, I think we're going to do that. How much has that boosted that up by? Uh, we've gone 16 up to 24, I'm guessing, yep. Uh, maybe we want to put another one in for some expansion power. Uh, we don't appear to be losing money, so let's do that. Boom. Okay, that, that is good. We, we should have enough power now to see us through anything that we choose to do. And what I choose to do today is this section here. I mean, it looks... Alright, I suppose, but kind of the first thing I want to do, if we can possibly do it, is get rid of these roads here. Not to completely get rid of them, but just like that, if it will. Uh, no, like like that. Yeah, a little little dead-end cul-de-sac. Oh, no, that's that's not what quite I want to do. A little dead-end cul-de-sac will probably be ideal here. Uh, so that they all have to go through and use this big main road. Another thing that I want to do is kind of get this hooked up somehow. Maybe have some small slip roads coming down to this. Um, but I think we're all right for now. I think we're all right for now. Let's take a moment to look at things like our health of our citizens. Now, obviously, with this being our health center, things are going to be a little bit awkward on this side over here. Uh, we could drop it here to make things a bit better, but I think this is actually okay. It's not, not really anything we're, we're really going to worry about. Uh, the other things I'd like to take care of are things like education. How, how well educated are my people here? Not massively there, there are definitely issues to be had here mainly because our um, school is up here when well, it would be quite nice to have it down here maybe um, let's try that let's destroy this one up here and see what happens uh, hopefully this will be completely better um, I, I mean we can hope that I mean what else can we possibly do other than hope um, I suppose we could lay down some good policies and plan through and, and do things properly, but that's not the way I do things. Alright, I think over here might also be another place where we can start mucking around with roads, but I would like to put on another uh, another bit of building here. Uh, another bit. Another housing estate. That's the word I'm looking for. Another housing estate would go down wonders. As we can see here, we have more uh, demand for the stuff that we have. So I'm thinking... This space here looks like prime area. We can have maybe a road coming off here, join up with that eventually. Um, yeah, okay, so let, let's think about doing that. I'm just going to take a normal road for now, and we're going to take it straight up to here, maybe? Yeah, that looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. Uh, hopefully that's parallel. It's a bit hard to tell. It is a bit hard to tell. If we uh, drag this down here, what's going to happen? Uh, looks all right. Looks all right. Yeah, okay, so here's a, a nice little side road that should hopefully be able to uh, accommodate everything we need to do. Now, what are we going to put in here? Let's have a look. We have enough room to do some pretty crazy stuff. So I think what we're going to do, we're going to start... We want to start away from the wall, obviously. Uh, the uh, roundabout, that's the word I'm looking for. We don't want... Oh, not enough money. Are we out of money already? Quick, turn up the speed of the thing. Oh, wow, that's... that's uh, Incredible. It wasn't exactly what I was trying to do. Something like that looks to be good. And then we can have the same coming this way to about here. Okay, well, it looks like this is all we're going to be able to do whilst we want to put down stuff like this. Okay, that's fine. Hopefully the expanding um, housing estates and stuff like that will give us enough population to be able to do stuff with. We are, of course, on our way up to the tiny town population uh descriptor I suppose is the way to call it one and a half, one and a half thousand that will give us high schools I'd kind of like to be able to make use of the high schools as and when they turn up I'm now thinking that maybe the elementary school did actually want to be over here because that then got, has better access to everything else but we will move stuff around as and when we need to there appears to be a bit of a crime rate problem do we have access to the police we do have access to the police where would we like to put a police station I mean obviously down here no not enough money. Well, of course we've not got enough money. Uh, this will just have to be something that we have to muck around with. The building is burnt down. We do actually have 
fire stations around. So why has this happened? I should imagine it's because they're so far away. Um, so over here, where was it? Was this our fire station? No. Where was our fire station? Do we not actually have a fire station? Okay, well, I now understand why that's a problem, and we are going to address that as soon as possible. Uh, unfortunately, we can't address it right now, uh, due to the absolute horrendous lack of money that we have. Also, it's middle of the night. You know, we can't sort anything out in the middle of the night. No one can see what they're doing. How are my workers supposed to be able to do anything? There we go. Let's just throw that little bit of water in there. Uh, we are looking for how much is it going to be? We are looking for 12,000. Oh, wow. Well, we're at seven already. So if we just uh, carry on skimming around, I'm sure everything's going to be okay. The crime, crime rate. Crime rate? Yeah, the crime rate is ridiculous. It's all good telling me to have a look at the new services. But look, we can't do it. Why would you tell me to have a look? I think uh, we need to get rid of that. Um, okay, so we've got a bit of a problem here. Um, let us just do these things. Okay, so the crime rate is, is actually really starting to get quite terrible around here. Uh, but we should be able to... I mean, what's more important? Crime rate or fire? I mean, I'd really like to get the fire down because, you know, that will stop us uh, destroying places and things and, and all sorts of stuff. Maybe that's a good spot. Boom. I think that's probably the best spot that we have at the moment. Not so good around this way. Uh, we will definitely do something about that. But right now, uh, we need to worry more about the crime rate. Wow, look at this place. I have never experienced such a high crime rate in one of my playthroughs. Uh, I am astounded. Uh, astounded in my ass. Okay, what else can we do here? Let's get some more roads in because we've got like this. Look at look at this area. This this definitely needs some work. Uh, even if it's just here, I mean, I would really like to put some little one-way systems in. Okay, so like this, if we could just get it. Come right, right, you know, we need the uh, the funny road angle, right? If we get this coming out here, the medical clinic is on fire. That's um. Most unfortunate, thinking about it. Like, most, most unfortunate. Look at this. Look at this. Look what's going on. Ha! <laughs> Fire! Uh, crime. Crime is an issue. Uh, we, we really need to try and get this sorted. Um, very much. Oh, look, at, look at this. Is that, is that screenshot worthy? I think it might be. I think it might be. Wow. Uh, crime is a problem. So what are we going to do with the criminals? Well, obviously, we want to try and put them in the police cell uh though again we have the problem so are loans a thing are loans a thing loans are a thing how much do we want to take uh we could take 20 grand that will just about cover the stuff we need to do we can play it back over a year for five percent interest it's a lot of money coming out but if we have a look i think we should be all right so let's take up take hold of that and we should be done by the end of the year with that so we we just need to get this in uh i know i i, I really don't like taking loans it, it's really not the way i like to do things but i think it has to happen occasionally it has to happen occasionally why is it that oh it's because the road's short right okay so if i put it here no it doesn't quite do everything i wanted it to do well, it looks like we're going here. It's kind of going to have to do. It's kind of going to have to do. The police station goes up and around that way. I'd like to get another one-way road coming off of here, just so that people have a way in and out uh, without doing too much to muck around about it. Like that. That. Oh, that looks horrendous. Wasn't quite the look I was going for, but I think it will do. I think it will do. Hopefully now we've got going to watch all these disappear and the housing value will go up and we've got a problem with power here. Slow down the game. Slow down the game. We've got a problem with power. This is not something to, to sit around and just watch happen. Uh, maybe like, like this. Though that said, I don't think those power lines are doing anything anymore. Uh, we seem to be doing all right with the town. Uh, we could definitely have used uh, a way of getting across here. I suppose that's kind of what this is for. These are obviously in uh, a very bad position. Maybe we want to dezone these. Uh, it is unfortunate. Look, I mean, we've got alarms going off. We've got abandoned buildings, an ice cube factory. It looks like a folk tech. I mean, that, that's crazy. That's crazy. More buildings about. Yeah, we're, we're going to dezone this this area here. There, there is no need to have these guys in so much trouble, is there? There we go. 
Hopefully that's now good. Oh, would you believe it? The power has died again. We can we can do this though. We can do it. There we go. That should help everybody out. That has helped everybody out. Uh, you should not be complaining about power. You do not belong there. Get out of my city. Never come back. You have darkened my doorway for the last time. All right. So what's the next thing we need to be going out? More residential. What a surprise. Uh, as if I didn't know that that was a thing that needed to be done. Uh, I think we can get definitely a bit more in here. Um, no, all right what we actually need. I wish there was a, an easier way of doing this. Maybe there's some hotkeys that I'm unaware of. Uh, that would be great if there were. I'm just completely unaware of them, of course, as I've just stated. Okay, that looks like a pretty good place to, uh, to have a little um, housing estate, stuff like that. I'm wondering whether we want to join this all the way across here so we've got just a little bit of a a thing. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, we're at Tiny Town. That means we get to have a high school. We can, like, ban pet smoking and uh, up to update our parks and recreation. Oh, look, we got access to the unique buildings. Look at these things. Okay, city produces a total of 5,000 goods. We can put the Statue of Liberty up. That's nice. We might want to do that. Yeah, we might want to do that. Let's, let's go and have a look. I'm sure things like that are going to do our city well. Uh, the first thing I want to do, though, is kind of just make this a working housing estate. There we go. Brilliant. Uh, the unique buildings. Yes. Uh, I, well, I don't know, but I don't want to read what you've got. So these are the landmarks. Landmarks are one of the things that are reached for having uh, certain requirements. As you see here, we need uh, 3,000 squares of industrial zone to be built upon to get the Eiffel Tower. Not going to be doing that for a while, I don't think. Uh, the Statue of Liberty, of course, is for having the... Uh, draws a lot of tourists. It, it didn't tell me what exactly it was we needed there. Uh, what do we have here? The Statue of Wealth. The Statue of Personification of Cities of Wealth. Requirement to build the uh, space satellite. So where do we want to build this? It makes a little bit of noise, but I've got a feeling it is going to be a uh, massive boon to... Oh, look at that. Brilliant. Boom. Massive boon to our uh, city. Just in general. It's going to be a nice area to, to have stuff. Uh, do we get roads and stuff we do look at this that's brilliant do we want to pop a few of these in in places like this here could definitely do with a bit of a road going across there not a road a pathway we of course have forgotten to put oh look oh that's terrible uh maybe not go there let's go all the way across to here and then we can get all this at once yeah that looks good to me that looks absolutely perfect to me uh so these guys here definitely want to become residential as well we want to start filling all these bits in. I mean, what goes here? What what could we possibly put here? Uh, I'm thinking some sort of pathway. Maybe we'll take out this tiny house here. Uh, that that works for me. Let, let's try it. The more pathways we're getting, I've got a feeling the better our residents are going to be at getting around. I'm hoping so, anyway. If not, well, then things are going to be in trouble. Uh, which means we should be able to start having bus routes soon. We don't have a bus route. That is a shame. Uh, people are complaining about power again. I mean, do they ever complain about anything else? Let's slow this down just a little bit. So we've got a nice little housing estate on the go here. I think it might be time to... Can we? To start playing about with districts. Start labelling stuff up so we can name stuff. Why, why is there just all-round power loss here? Let's, let's deal with that first. Power loss is obviously uh, something quite important. Maybe we want to build a power station over here, something that will help these guys. I don't think there's anything really we can put that's useful. Seven? Oh, oh, seven. Is there, is there an eight anywhere? We need to find an eight. No, six. Look, look, there's an eight over there. Oh, that's a seven as well. All right, back to the back to the beach side. At some point, these are all going to have to be replaced with houses and stuff because this is like some of the highest quality land that we have available. Man, things are getting expensive. Things are getting expensive. Uh, how much did the coal power produce? It produces, it doesn't tell us, 40 megawatts. 40 megawatts at fo uh, 56 of them. A month. Just trying to work out what's the best power output. Probably the coal power plant would be the best. Um, but we need to do things like hook it up to a road system and try and make sure everything's okay. Uh, we have access to the natural resource monitor now. This is great because it shows us things that we have. Like right here, we've got some ore that we can take advantage of. And on the top of the mountain, we've got all this forestry stuff we can take advantage of. I think we will be doing stuff with this. Um, because hopefully in our districts we have this where we can set up what type of industry things are doing. So over here we can we can set this up 
to the forested industry. Uh, I think we're going to have to send this road all the way over there, though. So let's try doing that first. Let's just do this up the hill like this. Uh, I would like to be able to see what it is we're aiming at. Boom. So we want to be able to go round the outside of this, maybe in a funny manner, but we, we'll tell. Can we, can we have both up at the same time? We can't. That is most unfortunate. So I'm going to do a little grid here, I think. Just a small grid should hopefully cover everything that I want to cover. Um, and of course, just this down the front here. Brilliant. Okay, we're going to set our first district, I think. What district are we going to call this? Well, it's going to be Forest Hills, I think, something like that. Uh, we're on a hill, it's full of forest. I'm using the wrong size. There we go. Cozy Square. I mean, who wants Cozy Square? Magnolia Square. I mean, we're getting closer. We are getting closer. No, I want uh, Tree Cutter's Way, right? Something like that. I don't, I don't know if that's a good name. If anybody has a better name for districts, yeah, by all means, shout them out at me. I, I am terrible at naming, as you guys should be well aware at this point. There's the forestry. We're going to tell it that this, that's just that. And then, hopefully, with the power of that, one. That should be good, right? Let's just kind of spread it around and see what happens. Uh, I don't think we want quite that much. Let's do this. Come down here like that. Brilliant. Uh, new pieces of land are available for purchase, but I don't think we want to do that quite yet. Uh, hopefully, as this comes down here, it will have full access to everywhere. That is my plan and hope. All right, so uh, I think we can quite happily just call this. Hang on, let's, let's get this all in. Yep, like that. We're going to call this the Sprawl. Because what else is it? There we go. The Sprawl. Brilliant. We've got a lot of children, teens, young adults. This this is good. This is good. I love it. I, I didn't see this uh, this like demographic breakdown before. I love it. Specializations. No specialization. Good. Good. We don't want any specializations. We do want to try and push the land value up a little bit. Um, but I think everything's going okay. We seem to have a bit of a parking issue here. I'm not sure if there's anything we can do about that. Uh, because I literally don't know if there's anything we can do about that. Things are getting a bit, bit stressed all around here. But uh, these are things we can take care of. Um, I'm kind of wondering whether it would be better to put a bit across there so other guys can come down here. I know, I've got a feeling at some point we're going to end up replacing this possibly with a clover leaf or something like that. I mean, we only have access to the small roundabouts at the moment. We don't even have access to any of the highway stuff, which is unfortunate because that's what these are. These are highway tiles. So it'd be nice to be able to stretch these up all the way up to the roundabout and then do something a bit more imaginative for all this. Ooh, look what we forgot to do. Look what we forgot to do. I, I don't know why I'm blaming you guys as well. It's kind of all entirely my own fault. Uh, is that good enough to cover everyone? It's not. Let's go up here and across here. That is a horrendous waste of pipe. Um, but let's let's just carry on for wasting pipe, shall we? Brilliant. Uh, maybe we'll just uh, can I get rid of these ones. There we go. Now we just have the electricity issue to worry about, but that's all right. We've got a great big long line here that we can just send this down. And as this fills up, if this fills up, it should. Uh, carry on uh, transmitting electricity across with it hopefully hopefully all right well as night time settles on this i think it's time to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure guys i will see you next time where we're gonna uh, try and make the sprawl a little bit nicer uh hopefully make our way up to some sort of like Highway wielding level. Uh, I don't know if this is the highway wielding level. No, it's not. That's, uh, we don't want busy town. Boom town. That's the one we want. Uh, and look, we get highway and all sorts. So next time we will definitely be upgrading this. We get also get to do things like, you know, play about with uh, cemeteries, bus depots, putting down bus lines. Next line will definitely be one to look forward to. And we get more unique buildings and stuff like that. The unique buildings are definitely the stuff that I want to be able to uh, put down at this point in time. Or the unique buildings are what my focus are going to be for most of this playthrough, I think. Being able to uh, meet all these requirements to get stuff done. But anyway, I will see you then when we're going to do that. Bye!